There have been questions over cell phones and cancer before, but for the first time, a leading researcher, Dr. Ronald Herberman, issues a warning. In a memo to his staff at the University of Pittsburgh Cancer Research Center, Herberman warns that children should use cell phones only in emergencies and that fetuses are most at risk. Phone user Marjorie Newman tells a reporter exactly what the risk would be. Brain cancer. Previous studies in several countries have found no evidence that heavy use of cell phones causes cancer. At the American Cancer Society, Dr. Michael Thune has followed these studies closely. All the evidence we have so far is that they're safe, but as I say, it's impossible with science to prove that something is absolutely safe. The National Cancer Institute says cell phones do emit radio frequency energy, a form of radiation. The Institute points out Hello? several long-term studies on a relatively new technology, and it calls attention to the growing number of users, more than 180 million in the U.S. and more than 2 billion worldwide. Heberman's warning is based on an ongoing research project on the health effects of cell phone usage. He suggests faculty members take action even before the data is published. As for worried cell phone users, I'll get myself a wireless headset. In the absence of conclusive evidence, that is exactly what doctors recommend. A headset or a speakerphone to keep the phone's possibly harmful radiation further from the brain. Carolyn Persuti, VOA News.